Yes, my people, you don't happen again. No, the tea don't suck again. Yes. Fast Falala, don't shout out. You don't come out. You know, no damn musician, huh? When papa na big lawyer for Nigeria, he don't come out. He say, this election when they grant, what did they happen? So, if all the celebrities when they Nigeria not talk put, he say, he will they stand with OB, he will stand with the all the whole obedience. He say, nothing they happen. He say, ah, he say, if not be Mahmoud when read the election, he say, who be APC when go fi win this last election, what we do for Nigeria? For presidency, he say la la oh, he say make the carry and go where they want carry and go. He ready to stand for his right. He say make all the Nigeria youth stand. He say this 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 the last opportunity. We must take it back. He say we must get the new Nigeria. Oh. Look as I tell you so. Make you they share this video. Make you they like and make you they comment so that Facebook will recommend it to other people. Don't forget say we have national actor on this platform. Name be Laba Brun Brun Laba. My people. This guy caught you know. This guy they caught you. Not be small thing. As the papa they caught you. No wonder they say like father like son. You go see this video. You understand what they talk. This one will be telling me. I can tell you. See him by yourself. Not all. This has absolutely nothing to do with your tribe or your religion. This is about competence. And with everything that we suffer as a country. With all the problems that we're facing. It is so sad that in 2023, so many people allowed that tribal sentiment to get to them. And they went to vote based on tribe. And, oh, man, it was, it was just so sad to see. And, you know, like I said earlier, on, the only way we can move past all this is to really, really overlook all these sentiments. The way in this country to move forward... After what seems to be the yawning divide created by this election, I mean, we've seen it along the lines of politics, religion, ethnicity. How do you think that we can build a bridge across it? I think we have to look beyond... When I say we, I mean the ordinary citizens. We have to look beyond... All these differences, all these things that the ruling party always capitalizes on and weaponizes against us. We have to look beyond these things, things like tribe, religion. These are differences. Everyone is entitled to have their, di their differences, but these things don't define us. At the end of the day, we're all Nigerian. I, when I look at my fellow Nigerian, I don't see their tribe. I don't see anything else but another Nigerian. And going into these elections, going to cast my vote, I was looking for competence. I was looking for who would do the job. Who, who do I think is capable of doing the job? I wasn't looking at, oh, who is from my tribe? And that's why it, it was really, really, really infuriating when I was getting a lot of these messages and people sort of attacking me and saying, uh, uh, you know, throwing around all these uh, slogans, these slogans just fueling bigotry uh uh stuff like oh yoruba ronu or <laughs> you know it, it just didn't make any sense to me because this is not a war of tribes this has absolutely nothing to do with your tribe or your religion this is about competence and with everything that we suffer as a country with all the problems that we're facing it is so sad that in 2023 so many people allowed that tribal sentiment to get to them. And they went to vote based on tribe. And, oh, man, it was, it was just so sad to see. And, you know, like I said earlier, on the only way we can move past all this is to really, really overlook all these sentiments and just look at competence. Because if we do not have competent politicians, we will remain where we are as a country. And on that note, a uh, very powerful note, I want to thank you very much indeed, uh, Fowles, for joining us there from London. Following Falano, better known as Fowles, has just released a new politically charged song, uh, released with... When I see with tell now, yes now, it's good to be good. It's good to stand for, for your right. See, 
All those Nigeria youth when they support APC and PDP, they don't know what thing that they do. Now this kind of person, this far so now we need for Nigeria when he go the leaders. Very soon after we be maybe now he go be a, uh, the next president. Yes, he stand the now musician no. He not to say Papa don't make claim. Papa get money or he get money. No, he the stand for the poor masses. Is he stand make Nigeria better? If Nigeria better, go for him. He go for all of us. No be only in one. He get money to travel abroad. Do make go live a good life there. He get money to stay any country where he want to stay for the whole world. But he just want make that our country Nigeria better. Like the way when I want to make it better, now he himself want to make it better. As you they watch me so follow this page. Anytime I upload any new video, you will be the first person to see it. You understand, my people. Now the thing when I carry con, make on a touch light today. Now it be this. Don't forget to follow us as I said before. Like this video, share it so that other people will see it too. Let us take our country back, the new Nigeria. Thank you.